Afternoon everybody! Welcome to the weekend vlog. So I'm getting ready to wrap some presents. Um, we went to Walmart last week. We went to Walmart so many times this month guys. I'm like losing track of when we went to Walmart. But uh, we went to Walmart last weekend I believe. I think. <laughs> if not before then. <laughs> but we got some Hickory Farm sets at Walmart. Like you can get these in the mall but we just bought them at Walmart. And I'm giving two of these Hickory Farm sets to two people that I clean for because these two people that I had in mind really enjoys the Hickory Farms things and I think anybody would enjoy Hickory Farms. It's really good and um, it's just you can't really go wrong with food in my opinion. Giving like candy or food as a gift as long as it's something they like you can't go wrong with it because they're gonna eat it so I mean it's a good gift you know I don't know and then I got some pictures over here that I'm gonna wrap up this big picture is for my mom and dad they needed an updated picture of me and my brother so and then these are just like extra ones that I'm going there's one of me and my husband we took in front of our tree that I'm going to give to them and then an extra one of me and my brother that's a little bit different I have this one framed myself because I like it it's different and then I have one for my brother to wrap take to his new apartment in Morgantown, West Virginia. So my brother is moving. I never said anything about it on the vlog, but he is moving after Christmas and I'm really sad. My mom said that they're going out to stay at their apartment because they've already got an apartment out there, but they wanted to wait until after Christmas to just fully kind of move out, I guess. It's just kind of like keep my mom maybe company a little bit longer you know so it won't be so hard on her I guess because she's probably gonna be pretty upset and stuff and she's gonna be lonely because she's used to having somebody up there with her all the time and you know sometimes her and my dad are just like it's like they live in separate different homes or something even though they're in the same home sometimes they don't you know you know how that is <laughs> but uh, they got their own thing going on sometimes so she, she's gonna miss Hunter. She's She missed me when I moved out. And it's gonna take some time for her to get used to it. I'm gonna miss my brother a lot. Um, he's like my best friend. So I just, I don't know. If any of you guys have siblings, then you probably feel that way if you're close. Me and my brother were always close from the time that he was born till now. We were always close and I feel like I can tell my brother anything and he'll listen to me and he's not gonna go off and tell somebody what I said or anything like that so yeah me thinking about it's gonna get me teared up because I'm probably gonna cry when he leaves even though Morgantown's not that far but it's you know he's not gonna be right up the hill from me no more but I'm kind of happy in a way that he'll be in Morgantown at least so like when me and my husband we go there all the time which you guys know so when we go out there maybe we can stay with them or visit with them and it'll be nice so I'm just really happy that he's growing up and doing his own thing. It's just crazy to think about, but I'm gonna wrap some presents now. So we we're getting ready to leave We had to wait around and leave a little later than what we probably would have left if it wasn't like freezing rain and ice in in Hagerstown So we didn't get ice here. Thank God, but it is like rainy and Gloomy and nasty getting ready to go out and start my car and it's about 9 30 So We're going on a road trip It's 
icy here. <laughs> and we gotta go further north, so it's probably only gonna get worse. <laughs> Did we make it alive? Nope, still, still moving. I'm ready to get the fuck out of this car. Drink. Drink. It is really icy up here. There's the outlets. Looks kind of dead. Well, uh, the roads, <laughs> the roads are a little, a little dicey, baby. What are you doing? Adjusting my hat. Putting your new hat on? Yep. So we just walked down a row of the outlets and the weather is finally starting to get a little bit better here. It's starting to warm up. Beep. And Beep. oh great. Beep. Uh. <laughs> so we're gonna move the car down a little bit and walk down the next row of the outlet stores. And the best store we've been in so far is the Adidas store. Great hat, man. How much was it? Forty-four dollars. It was the not. It was the steel. It was not. How much is this? How much was it for real? Thirty-five degrees. How uh, much was it for real? Um, I don't know, like fifteen dollars. Pretty good for a hat, and I got a nice hoodie for twenty bucks, and he got a nice hoodie for twenty bucks, and I got some really nice gloves and for ten dollars. We went to Bath and Body Works and loaded up in there and spent way too much in there. And I wanted something from the North Face, but they didn't have my size and the stuff that I was liking. And honestly, it was a little bit too expensive too, but I don't know, it wasn't too bad, I don't guess. But I didn't buy nothing in there. I like my hat. I like your hat too. Mm -hmm. I was gonna get a hat and then I got gloves instead because I needed a pair of gloves. So I got gloves. We walked through this building and there's like a food court in there. You want to go to Columbia Sports School? You want to go on the other side and come back down this way? What do you want to do? The whole other right here is fine. We haven't seen any of this. All right. Well, I'm telling you, there's a whole other side over there. Okay, too. that's fine. I don't mind to walk. We want to just park over here or wherever. I will park over there. I think I want to go in there maybe, but I don't. I don't know. But every store is having like a sale. Yeah, it's if, like 50% off or 40% off. If you want to call, call it a sale. Yeah, like the North Face, like really, Adidas, they had them, Adidas, they had a coat in there for $200. So it was half off, so it'd make 100 bucks if you call that a good deal. I don't know, I guess. But North Face is a little bit crazy. But Adidas was a good store. This were my store, I picked it out. <laughs> We just got to a West Virginia Welcome Center. Uh, we got the hell out of Hagerstown because it only warmed up like maybe two degrees and it's 3.44 right now so we don't have a lot of time until it gets dark. And uh, we got the hell out of there because we do not want to get stuck in Hagerstown. It is really icy up here. It's really, really, like the whole ride in here I was so tense and like literally having an anxiety attack because it was scary. Mom and my two aunts are actually Christmas shopping in Winchester which is where we are going back to finish our shopping so I'm guessing we're probably gonna meet up with them but I don't like know 100% but I know our plan is to eat tonight at the Olive Garden because we have a gift card to eat there so we get dinner for free tonight which is pretty damn awesome and I'm excited about it. And I might have to get a drink because it's been like a really stressing, like the way in was really stressing me out. So, yeah, I'm going to have to get a freaking drink. Loosen the hell up. I need to get their alarm. 
But yeah, right now in Winchester, I think it's like 40 degrees, and here it's 33. Like, yeah, shit's gonna freeze up again soon. It's really, really bad. We, we went to the mall here. We literally parked the car and then realized, like, the temperature and stuff, and we we're like, why don't we just go back to Winchester and, like, finish our shopping there? And plus, we'll be closer to home as well. But I had a really good time with my husband at the outlet malls. Um, this is like a tradition for us because he brought me here like, um, I don't know, probably four years ago. So um, yeah, it's just really nice to be back and we got a lot, of, a lot of good deals and some really nice stuff. So I'm excited. Hope he don't bust his ass. Thanks, Bob. Thanks a lot, Bob. Why ain't focusing? There we go. Big old tree in the back of that yard. Oh damn. They got, that's tall. That's a tall one. Oh yeah. That tree on the other street though was cool looking. That's pretty. Those lights there. Wow. Holiday greeting from the heart. Call the Christmas message to family and friends. Then listen to decorate up down, down the rich tree here, is it? On the air. Call the L fly. L I N E. Let's say five three five three fifty four sixty three. What is the street even called? Stewart Street? Stewart, right? You guys ever come to Winchester, Virginia and go down Stewart Street? Dang, I like that. From Sirius XM Holiday Traditions. starting off the morning by wrapping some presents um it surprisingly got really warm here yesterday which was really weird it got almost 60 degrees last night freaking insane guys we was in Hagerstown yesterday which you guys know and it was like 33 so we got home last night and it was like 56 here or something and then it got warmer i think too what the heck i got out of the car last night and i was like oh it's not cold here it feels like spring it was like really weird but um anyways i'm wrapping some gifts it's about almost one o'clock in the afternoon so i'm kind of in the vlog a little bit late today but um we're not really doing much my husband's up in the living room putting his grill together that i got him for christmas it was just honestly too big and too heavy to wrap so that's why he already got that present early and um yeah i think we're gonna go to walmart <laughs> Yes, I did just say Walmart. 
again. I was just there yesterday, but we need to go again. My husband needs to pick up his um, pills there. So that's mainly why we're going is to go to the pharmacy at Walmart because that's where he gets that stuff at. And then we are going to pick up, I think just maybe like one or two other things and get the heck out of there because I'm about done with Walmart. <laughs> and yeah, I really don't know what else we're having plan to do today. I'm wrapping presents. I got videos to edit. I got this vlog to edit. I got a cleaning video to edit. And yeah, we're just being lazy. I took a shower. I spent some time getting caught up on YouTube videos this morning. And that's pretty much it. So I will update you guys when I'm doing something else. Well, it's official. I'm the worst vlogger ever. <laughs> hey guys. So today is actually Tuesday of before Christmas, the Tuesday before Christmas, which I think is the 20th, which means tomorrow is the first day of winter. Yay, not. <laughs> um, it was really cold out this morning. It was like 18 degrees. Yeah, that's cold. And um, yeah, I just got back from Walmart. I met up with Marissa and we went down to Walmart and I had to get a few things. I went to Tractor Supply and got my husband his coat for Christmas. Because that was one thing that we didn't get when we went shopping and I think my husband kind of just wasn't really worried about getting it until after Christmas. But I wanted to go ahead and get it for him because I know he needs a coat because he has no heavy coat. So I got him a Schmitz black coat. It looks like this from Tractor Supply and I got my lint like all over it. It looks horrible. I'm probably, I'll have to wash it anyways. But, um, yeah, so this is what it looks like. The inside's got, like, this, uh, waterproof fill material, but it's heavy lined, pretty much. So, um, yeah, that's how much it was, and it was actually on sale. I got it for, like, 35 bucks or something. It was real cheap. So, if he doesn't like this one and he wants the fleece lined one, then I'm, I saved the receipt so we can take it back and get him what he wants. But I just wanted to get it for him. He's going to get mad at me, though, because I used a credit card to buy it. <laughs> but, oh well, who cares? But, yeah, anyways, I have a Schmitz coat, too, right here. This is, like, mine. Mine's a little bit heavier, though. And, like, see, mine has this, like, that stuff in it that feels like wool or something. It's a, really warm. So, my husband is the type that this is his time of the year. Like, he likes winter. He likes the cold. He's not a summertime person. Like, he doesn't like to be hot. So he doesn't get hot any or he doesn't get cold anyway, so I think the coat that I got him will probably suit him just fine. But anyways, um I just got back getting ready to do some laundry. I gotta show you guys this real quick because this was an awesome Christmas present to me from the people I clean for. They made me a potato and onion bin and look at this. He actually carved this in it's a potato and then he wrote and onions instead of writing it out like theirs were they drew it and I don't know it's so so pretty and look at this this is insane guys and guess what like look at my trim guys it matches my freaking trim how crazy is that and this is the onion drawer and I didn't even notice the little knob that was on it look how cute that is you guys can see that wow but yeah you just put your onions in there and then your potatoes go obviously down in there and I've been wanting a potato bin for so long guys because I didn't really know where to put it because I'm out of room so I just set it there I don't know if it's gonna stay there because I'm not 100% sure if I like it there but I don't really have any room for it this over here is kind of a disappointment I wanted to set it like right in the middle but see the way the floor is and the vents there it's all messed up we need to repaint this because it looks horrible and it was going to originally, I wanted it to sit there, but it can't because the floor and the vent is all stupid. So, for now, it's between my washer and dryer, but I'm obsessed with it. It's so beautiful. And the fact that he can make anything, um, it's an older lady and an older man that I clean for. They're married, obviously. But they are so good to me, guys. And they make me something every year. Last year, they made me those shelves over on my wall. And the year before, they gave me this bread box that he made and he also made this paper towel little bearer thing little holder but um my the woman his wife actually is really good at painting 
and that kind of stuff so she did all like that detailed and he like did the wood and everything like he's really good at wood crafting just like my dad my dad can make anything as well but when you receive a gift from somebody that's homemade that's like the best kind of gift to get so i love it i'm excited i no longer have to throw my potatoes in a bag which this is what i was doing those are potatoes but those are going to my mom's house and yeah i'm obsessed with it i'm just glad that i got one because um i'm sure if you buy one in the stores like that is probably expensive and i just really appreciate them making me one of those i just can't even believe that i got that because i was like dang I really needed one of those, so I'm excited about it. So my husband just left. He has to get six teeth pulled today. He come home for his lunch break since he is only working in town now, which I love that he's a lot closer to home and he loves it too. So um, yeah, I'm not really doing much guys. Look at my presents. Look at all this crap. Like, all this stuff over here, though, goes to people, though. But look at this. Santa Claus had already hit this home. Man, it is packed out. So, yeah. We're ready for Christmas. My husband put his grill together the other night. He really likes it. So, I'm happy about that. This stuff here on the table is more presents that goes to my mom's. More stuff. I've already gave her some of her stuff, but this is more of it. So, she's supposed to stop by and get that in a little bit. And I'm going to vacuum my floor now and edit this vlog because this is supposed to be the weekend vlog and it's now Tuesday. I'm a little late, but you guys will see this probably tomorrow, I would say. So, um, yeah, I'm probably going to be vlogging this weekend for Christmas. So, yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed my vlogs. Subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single week. And I love you guys very much. And I hope you guys are having a happy holiday season. Bye!